Hey y'all, the real Jimmy Roberts one here, and we have something very important to look at here today. This should help everyone to better understand the level of deceit that we are dealing with with NASA and all that NASA implies. The main image that we will be using today is from Soul 3288. However, this context view is from Soul 3251, and it is a left mast cam image. Now, in our episode released just prior to this one entitled Mars Imagery Gets Even More Bizarre, we talked about a dome and we had measured it at about 13 meters in height. That's around 43 feet. Well, this is it seen here on the left side in this image. Now, this is important because the area that we're looking at here today is an area that's not yet mapped, so we cannot get a measurement of it. So just compare it to this on the left, which is about 43 feet from the top down to just below the base. And notice just how strange a formation this is, this large rectangular top that just sort of looks like it's fallen over. Now, let's get to the good stuff. While we still have this up for context, I want you to know that we're going to be looking right in that area. I have maintained for years that the level of fraud in images like this is far higher than what most reasonable people are willing to accept. But you know what? They left an opening and I can prove it today. There is a large robotic arm strapped down right here. Working with four and six axes robotic arms is part of what I do for a living, folks. I know one when I see it. Now, the end effector on this, the part of a robotic arm that interacts with the environment, it suggests it may open up and be a sort of bucket scoop, you know, to move large amounts of soil. However, that would make this heavy machinery, and you're usually going to have some type of actuator or normally a hydraulic cylinder to move arms that are going to move a lot of weight like that. I don't see that. That does not mean that they weren't there because this thing is strapped down. It's defunct. It's being moved, stored, something. And from the look of the shoulder axis, it suggests to me that this is servo-driven, motor-driven, which doesn't usually move really large things. It does things like weld, paint, now, this is another mast cam image, a right mast cam image from Soul 3232. And you can still see the arm here, although it's very vague here. The obfuscation is a lot more severe in this image. Now, really, we're just getting started here because how much is being hidden in this image? What is this? Just a big scrap heap? All of these hills, mounds, buttes are under disguise, folks. There's something completely other than what we're seeing. And what's going on here? We'll be back soon. We're just getting started now.